Welcome back to Chaos Corner. It's your old buddy, the guardian of chaos, Big Daddy. And I tell it like it is. I'll save that to say this. Coming to you live to tape from the Chaos Lounge. Here at Chaos Headquarters. We just came out of an unbelievable matchup. And I will say that to say this. Bianca Belair is the new SmackDown. Wait, wait. New Raw ladies champion don't you hate the whole separation of raw and smackdown brand can't we have one champion but what a match the two ladies put on bianca belair is perhaps one of the most athletic female grapplers to ever step inside the ring and becky lynch for as cringe as she is when she sells and <laughs> it's so cringe but i'll say again it was a good match, a solid match. The two ladies so far may have put on the match of the night. Bianca Belair, again, I, I can't sell this lady's uh, uh, accolades anymore, but I called it. I thought it was pretty predictable. I had said it in the opening monologue. If you go back and check out the videos, uh, uh, thanks for being here. WrestleMania 38, night one, and uh, so far, it's interesting in the placement and what's going on here so far in WrestleMania 38, night one. We started off with, let me check my notes, the Usos defending the SmackDown Tag Team titles over Ricky Boogs and Nakamura. Uh, McIntyre over Happy Corbin was the second bout. The third bout saw The Miz and Logan Paul in a highly entertaining match over Dominic and Rey Mysterio. Booyaka, booyaka, booyaka. And then we had Stephanie McMahon, I almost said Shane, Stephanie McMahon came out and introduced USA Olympic hero and NCAA uh, champion Gabe Stevenson is now signed with the WWE. And of course, we just had the very entertaining match of Bianca Belair winning the WWE SmackDown or Raw ladies title. Doesn't matter which one. I guess it's the Raw brand. She is now the ladies title in an unbelievable matchup. I can't say the praises enough of the of Bianca Belair and the two ladies, but it was predictable. So night one, WrestleMania 38 has been nothing spectacular. And right now they're showing the whole vignette and storylines of how crazy Seth Rollins has been. Seth freaking Rollins with Vince McMahon. And they're in Stamford right down this road here at 95. A stone's throw in the shadows of Titan Towers here at Chaos Quarters headquarters. They're showing Rollins there in Stamford and trying to sell his way. And if you've been watching Raw and SmackDown uh, into a WrestleMania match. Uh, Seth Rollins is, I like how entertaining he's become. He's kind of been lost. He's been around for a while. He's been pushed. He's not been pushed. His, his, his character has turned me off. Other times I've been very interested. I like this quick storyline around here. A lot of people have been talking about it. I like his aggravating heel style here. And who will the opponent be? There's been a lot of conjecture on who Seth freaking Rollins' opponent will be. Will Cody Rhodes show up tonight and be his opponent? There's been other people mentioned. I don't want to fathom a guess. The whole world is watching and saying it's going to be Cody Rhodes. So let's see what happens as they run through the vignettes. Because this is at Vince's, the storyline is his request, his demand. Who will it be that will take Seth Rollins' place? Everyone said it was going to be Austin Theory at one time. Then they thought Pat McAfee, strike one, strike two, you're out. It's not Vince McMahon, strike three. Will it be uh, Shane O'Mac? I mean, who, who knows what's going to happen? Are they going to bring someone back? But Rollins has been a freak as I watch the vignettes here. It's been entertaining. I've been up to state for before. Uh, it was in the 90s. Uh, yeah, I got in the gate. I'm like, yeah, yeah. After this, we still have the KO show. Kevin Owens, and you know it's going to be Stone Cold 316. He's going to whoop your ass. Wait, and they're opening up with a big chorus here, and it's going to be Seth Rollins coming out. A bunch of people dressed up with cowboy hats, young people on both sides of the entranceway here at WrestleMania 38. Interesting to see what's going to happen. Will this be the surprise? And don't forget, before you get to Stone Cold and the KO show, 
you have the SmackDown Ladies Champion. I guess I got it right. It's going to be Ronda Rousey against the Queen Charlotte Flair, the 13-time champion. Now, here comes Seth freaking Rollins in like a teal-type robe. Uh, uh looking magnificent uh with the whole crowd and all the kids up there singing i like this about rollins wrestlemania 38 night one live to tape watch along a little more subdued goc uh, jimmy smith really sold that last match as an announcer too look look rollins with his robe Seth freaking Rollins. Who is it going to be? Depending on who it is, it's depending on whether I'll stay here for the whole segment of live to tape. Again, Bianca Belair, the last segment. Becky Lynch, I didn't tape it. I didn't go live to tape. I got the entrance. Uh, and now i just giving you the results here. I didn't go live to tape for that. I knew it would be a, a, a big segment. Everyone would be covering it. So that's why we're covering it here. And leading into Seth freaking Rollins. Again, we still got Rousey and Flair. And then the KO show with Stone Cold. Who's going to show up? Will Booker T come out with Stone Cold? Shawn Michaels? He called them all out in his segments, KO. He's been crazy. He's been entertaining. Perhaps uh, some of their best. And, and again, the product, uh, I'm not huge on the WWE. But I'm covering it for the brand here. For the channel. For the content. And, and for the relief, the stress of what's going on in the world for all of us, stay strong. Never fear. Don't doubt anything. You have the man upstairs. We're in that season. We're in Easter's coming up. Good Friday. We have the whole Lenten season. If you believe you're a Christian, you're a good person. Respect everybody. Walk with faith, like-minded people, critical, independent thinking. And again, from a Paul from off the off the desert grid, uh, your podcast, YouTube that I watch. And Jesus Christ is coming back. Don't be caught dead without him. And I'll say that to say this. Let's get back to night one, WrestleMania 38, and the big announcement here. Let's see what's going to happen. It's on the network. It's on the... I don't want to say it too loud because my wife and everybody gets crazy when I do this. Who is it going to be? Who is back in the booth? Is that Pat McAfee back in the booth? Is that Corey Graves? Who's in the booth right now? Now they're waiting for the announcement. Let, let, let's get, Can I turn up the volume here? Should I turn it up? Who's it going to be? He's waiting. Rollins is in the ring. Again, if you watched last night, Ring of Honor was great. Presented by AEW, whatever you want to say. The Briscoes, FTR, one for the ages. Them boys and FTR. FTR, now the champions of Triple A, Ring of Honor, maybe soon for AEW. The appearance of Samoa Joe. I wanted to throw that in here if you're watching all the way through. Rollins is waiting, 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 waiting here at WrestleMania 38, live to tape. Night one. Tomorrow night will be a big night. I'll be bouncing back and forth on that for sure. I'll be back here for Rousey and Flair too. And Kevin Owens and Stone Cold. I'll be back. There goes the pyrotechnics. We're a little over eight minutes in on this segment. Let's see who it's going to be. What are your bets? Put it in there. Is it going to be Kane? Is it going to be Bray Wyatt? Who will it be? A lot of conjecture. The lights are dark except for the ring. The lights are completely out. Is it going to be Bray Wyatt? All the lights are out. This is like the Wyatts. No fucking Cody Rhodes if you've been paying attention. What? Listen to the crowd. They're announcing over 70,000 people there. The crowd's erupting. Here we go. Over 70,000 is what they're announcing for the attendance. Here it is. And everybody was right. It wasn't. Look at, listen to the music. The red, white, and blue. The emblem. No copyrights here. I guess this was the only way you could have done it. Rising up like a phoenix. There he is. Listen to the reaction. It's Cody Rhodes. Cody is here at WrestleMania 38, night one, live to tape in Chaos Corner. This will be out before everyone could report it on YouTube. So it is going to be 
the American nightmare, the American dream, former AEW EVP, the American nightmare they're announcing him as, Cody Rhodes against Seth freaking Rollins. Everyone called it. It was pretty obvious, but there's conjecture. Conjecture. Did I say conjecture? I think I did. The American Nightmare. Here in Chaos Corner. The fans really pop, really sounding good here. Obviously, you knew Cody uh, was going to come in as the face against Seth Rollins, especially how, with how crazy he's been acting. The tattoo on the neck, the whole American theme, the Patriot theme, kissing the white belt that he has. Presenting it to a kid at ringside. Cody Rhodes is back in WWE. Who knew it would turn out this way? So I guess we'll stay here. This is going to be a long segment. Unless I pop off quick, download it, and come back. Cody Rhodes, no longer All Elite. The war is going back. I don't like to use that because we're wars, rumors of wars, actual war in the current day, 2022. We're here in April. WrestleMania 38, night one. But you get it, the whole WCW, WWF back then, the AEW, WWE, uh, just a, a year or two ago, and now back to this again. Jumping back and forth, the different talent. Let's see how long before, if and when it fizzles out. Who do you have for this matchup? Cody Rhodes, Seth freaking Rollins, Samoa Joe last night for AEW, Ring of Honor, I guess we'll call it. And now Cody back in the WWE. The nightmare. And it's been big in the atmosphere, the industry. The lately, this is what we do. This is why this. there's millions of people that watch this every week. Listen to the fans. I'll soak it in, then maybe pop off. And otherwise, this is going to be a 30-minute segment. Cody Rhodes, Seth freaking Rollins here at Chaos Corner. Live to tape. There's the bell. WrestleMania 38, night one. So far, There's, it's been okay. It's been entertaining. I'm not going to bash it. Let's give you the good, the bad, and the ugly. Let's see what's going to happen here. Big effect, big pop. They got what they wanted. Fans, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Live to tape. Chaos Corner. WrestleMania 38, night one. Cody and Seth freaking Rollins. Don't you dare miss it. 